this is a perfect day for soup. It's rainy, cold, mixture of snow. Soup is gonna warm up our bones. Hello, welcome to my final fall Friday soup. Can you believe it? Oh my goodness. I was getting all the stuff, setting up for this video, and it hit me. This is my last fall Friday soup for 2020. September, where have you gone? For today's soup, I am making an Italian wedding soup. I found this recipe online from The Cozy Cook. I will have the link down below. The recipe only calls for half a pound of pork and half a pound of hamburger, but I had decided to buy about a pound each because I am going to freeze the leftovers. I'm gonna make it all into meatballs, so I will have meatballs for future meals. For the meatballs, you are gonna need a half a pound of burger, half a pound of pork, and then an egg, breadcrumbs, minced garlic, Parmesan cheese, salt, pepper, and parsley. Like I said earlier, I am doubling this recipe for the meatballs, but I will have the recipe for the single serving for meatballs down below. And you need coffee for the cook. I added my eggs. A cup of Italian breadcrumbs. Some Parmesan cheese. Calls for three cloves of garlic. The recipe calls for a third cup of fresh parsley. I am using dried parsley. Final ingredient is salt and pepper. And now you're gonna use the best kitchen hand tools ever, and that is your hands. And you're going to mix, mix, mix. Make sure it's all incorporated. And then I will roll them into meatballs, put them in a pan with a little bit of olive oil, and start cooking them. The recipe said not to cook the meatballs all the way through because the middle of them finished cooking in the soup. The leftover meatballs that I am going to freeze, I actually made those bigger because I think those would be really good in like meatball sliders or meatball subs, spaghetti with bigger meatballs. Mm. Vegetables for the soup are very simple. There are chopped onion, chopped carrots, and chopped celery. The soup takes two boxes of chicken broth, which is perfect because if you remember last week, I had a box of chicken broth left over from that soup. So I get to incorporate it into this soup. I only had to buy one box of soup and it just worked out perfectly. I'm going to saute the vegetables a little bit, get them softened, and then I'm going to add a tablespoon of garlic. Going to add two teaspoons of Italian seasoning. And now the chicken broth. And salt and pepper. Now I'm going to bring this up to a boil. I am still bringing the soup up to a boil. But I have decided I'm going to add these meatballs into the soup right now and then they can finish cooking inside the soup and then it will reach a boil and hopefully finish cooking these. This is a new pasta to me. I have never used this before. I think it's called, I'm going to say it wrong, I just know I am, Asini de Pepe. I'm excited to be using this. I like using different things in my recipes, but it only calls for three-fourths of a cup. And I'm going to keep the rest of this pasta in a gallon size bag because it's so small, I do not want this stuff getting spilled in my pantry. I can't even imagine what the cleanup would be like if this teeny tiny little pasta spilled all over. I let the soup come up to a boil and then I let those meatballs boil in the broth for 10 minutes. 
Now I am going to add the pasta and I'm going to let it cook for another 10 minutes, just on simmer. With the meatballs that I'm going to freeze, I'm actually gonna get two different meals out of them, which I am so happy about. One, we decided to do spaghetti and meatballs. And then the other, we decided to do meatball sliders. So I'm going to put six meatballs in the meatball slider bag and then the rest will go in for spaghetti and meatballs. At this point, you just add eight ounces of fresh spinach. You're gonna let that wilt down into the soup and then it is ready to serve. That's going to do it for Fall Friday Soups this year. I hope you and your family enjoy these soups that we have shared with you this month. We really have enjoyed these soups. Yes, we have. And this one isn't vegetarian. No, it isn't. 50-50 <laughs> this month. That's right. That's right. We've had two of the, with me and two without. You did good, honey. You hey, hung in there. Hey, they were, they were good. I'm so proud That's of you. Enough. They were good. All right. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you soon. Bye.